What's up everyone, Esperin here, coming 101, we're going to do another Ghostbuster um, thing, because I never noticed something about my own toys, and now I looked it up because I noticed something was different, pretty sure a lot of you are going to laugh at this, and a lot of you are going to be like, we already know this dude, but some of you probably didn't know about this, so I'm going to show you something, okay, yes there's different color print on the gel of the Ghostbuster for Peter, there's also one that was that you actually see through this one but that's not the point now this was given to me this protopon proto prototype proto 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 I can't even talk today so I may need to buy another one but this is the first print of the Ghostbuster pack the reason why I say that because look at you notice anything the yellow cord is actually on the bottom of the proton pack how crazy is that? I didn't. I was like, okay, because I saw his his prototype pack, and then I look at the other ones. I'm like, wait a minute. So yeah, the hose, the yellow hose, the original, the very, very, very first original Ghostbuster toy on a proton pack were actually made at the bottom. <coughs> However, Winston. Okay, let me get all of it. Somebody gave this to me as well, and I gotta go find another one because when they gave it to me, the thing wasn't even attached to it, so I had to like put like a rubber band around it to hold them. But if you look at it, this is a second print. This is where they start doing this more often. They put it in the middle of the bumper. Now on the bottom, look at it. They even sealed the bottom part on. And now they put it on there. Isn't that weird? And of course, there's different colors on this guy too. Purple, uh, yellow, green. And those are like, I think those are like the bootlegs ones. But they also have a see-through one and a glow-in-the-dark one of him. And then Ray. <coughs> you know, like I said, somebody gave this to me. And this piece is like, looks like I chewed off by a dog or something. Okay, find another print, maybe. But once again, second print, maybe right there on the bumper. Not on the bottom. Just on the bumper. So there's that. And of course, there's different prints of this guy right here. Bootleg and not bootleg. He's got different colors, and there's a glow in the dark version of him as well. However, Egon. Egon is the second print. Look at that. Sealed on the bottom, but second print, the Ryan bumper. And this one's actually pretty good, decent, so. Can't complain, I got these from a friend, so. There's that, of course, there's different color bootlegs of them as well. However, I've noticed something else that I saw in my own eyes. There's two different versions of Winston. If you remember my other review, there's one where, let me turn off the light real quick. There's one where his um, armband right here doesn't exist. So there's one with it and there's one without it. And then there's another one I saw and that was actually from Mexico. Not a bootleg, but there's one with his collar and a zipper part. And this piece right here is all yellow. So there's three different versions of this one. Haven't seen anything yet on the other guys yet. I'm still looking around, still studying it. They all have their armbands, so that's a good thing. But yeah, I was like, well, I was pl putting these together in my in a little um, a little jewelry bag so that they could have all their stuff together. I was putting this on him, and then that's when I started realizing why is this on the bottom and these are attached to the middle. So I looked online, I was reading about it. And um, this thing, did you know thing, and um, said that this is the very first print of all the Ghostbusters. They all started off at the bottom, which it makes more sense, though, because that's how it's supposed to look, right? I mean, I was doing it on the bottom, then put it in the middle, but they thought it was a good idea by putting the tube in the middle for some strange reason. 
So my question is to you guys, which one do you guys own? Do you have the original print or do you have the second print? Now, I don't know if there's any other prints out there. I'm Like I said, I'm still looking through it. And I know a lot of you are like, we already knew this. This is old news. But you know what? People like me who are just realizing something is different, you know, cut us some slack. You know, there's people out there going to be like, wait, I didn't even notice that. So, like I said, this, I mean, I know this is old news, but, you know, there's going to be like someone out there who's going to be like, wait a minute. Um, there's other ones out there that I just discovered too, of the ghosts and monsters are all painted differently. So we will do those later. Um, now I'm going to have to go out to go, um, toy hunting and find me two of these like two of you know another one and their proto packet because i took a picture of which one i have so i could look for the second print peter vakeman and first print of the other three so now i'm going to have like it doubles but they're going to be different if that makes any sense to anyone or i might have to look for another one because like i said this guy gave it to me and um they were halfway broken which i didn't complain because you know it was free ish so, I may have to look for those as well, for a better, you know, for a better, um, built, that's not broken. So, that is my review I want to share with everyone, just in case nobody didn't know about this, so they get to, so you guys could go out and start toy hunting for your second, um, you know, your double, you could buy some doubles for yourself as well. Um, so more to come people. Just want to share this with you and happy hunting. Take care.